Hello, John Croner with Bullseye Trader, and I'd like to welcome you to today's market and holly update for Monday, April the 2nd. Let's get right to it and take a quick look at the markets today. And all our major indices were down again. Uh, the IBB uh, had the uh, greatest percentage loss down $4.26. And you can see uh, down below the 200 day moving average. Uh, the Qs uh, were, were down 2.7%, $4.28. They are still above the 200 day moving average, but uh, definitely uh, headed down. Uh, you know, anything can still happen from here, but uh, we better be uh, thinking about our short pants real soon if we haven't already. The Russell 2000 just bounced right off of that 200 day moving average, uh, so it is still slightly above it. The Dow bounced off of the 200 as well. So uh, you can see uh, where we uh, are there. The spiders, they, they uh, blew through it and stayed below it. Uh, looked like maybe it would come back and, uh, you know, stop just above it, but it didn't quite make it back to it. So, uh, you know, we're below the 200-day moving average on that. Now, you know, gold was up a little bit today, uh, pretty much... Uh, you know, not, not, not a major move, but just to take a look at the gold, uh, we, we have that. Uh, now, Monday is our day that we always have our trade of the week, and uh, our trade of the week this week is General Electric. Uh, now, this was contingent upon it trading at the uh, $14 mark, uh, which was the high of the other day. Uh, we have a stop down at $12.74 with an upside target of $18. So, uh, that's our trade of the week. And as you can see with the down market, uh, we, we certainly did not hit it, but we've got several more days here. And you can see Holly actually called GE last week uh, and she had you know, the two good positive days. So if we break that high of uh, you know, three days ago, you know, we, this trade will be considered active, but until then it is not. Once again, you should uh, evaluate uh, all your own trades and get into them because you feel we're not offering you advice or telling you what to do here. Now, let's go ahead and take a fast look at Holly today also. Uh, you know, as we can see on Holly, uh, we had a uh, you know, risk off uh, profit of 63 cents. Uh, our risk on uh, profit was $1.48, so it was definitely a risk on day. If we take a look at uh, what we had, and let me go ahead and get my file opened up here. Okay, as we can see here, we had seven short trades uh, for the, uh, you know, and obviously they met the daily totals of the 63 cents profit, $1.48 risk on profit. There were no long trades. And if we uh, look at uh, the trades, her, her best trade was the AMAG. And you can see here, uh, you know, what she did there. Uh, you know, she came to the table with only one short strategy. All the rest were long. And with, uh, you know, the political news and everything going on with the trade wars, you know, we definitely had the uh, strong market pullback. So the one short trade was it. it it's not too often that we've had Holly pick all shorts and no longs for a given day. Uh, you know, so that was a rarity, but she definitely uh, gave us the market bias that it was uh, going to be on the downside, and uh, she was certainly right. So uh, Holly uh, had a good day there. She only got stopped out on one trade, uh, which was this EC right here, and you can see that even though she got in, she got stopped out right away. You know, if, if you wouldn't have gotten in right away, you had an opportunity to get in and go ahead and make some alpha on that trade also. And once again, the risk on, she would have ended up positive. Uh, but, uh, you know, she, she did get out uh, on the uh, hitting her stop. Uh, so, so, so that's what, what happened there. And, you know, it, it's still a good time to take a look at our free ebook that we're offering you. Uh, Five ways to uh, win in a post BTFD market. Okay, so uh, you can download this free ebook right here. You know, uh, bit.ly forward slash bullseye trader free ebook. I'll have that listed in the uh, notes for you as well. 
and then also we would like to uh, remind you to uh, you know if you like what you saw down here at the lower right go ahead and click that uh, thumbs up uh, that you like this video share it with your friends subscribe to this page you can follow us uh, on our blog at bullseyetrader.com like us on Facebook follow us on Twitter and stock twits I want to thank you very much and have a great evening